What's up everyone? It's a for sale for trade video I'm doing. Um because what's been happening, uh I've been putting out the videos too late, like from weeks ago, and people are seeing stuff that I say I want to trade, but then by the time the video comes out, they're already gone. So this is gonna be everything I have for trade for sale. Um the only form of payment I'm going to accept is PayPal. Uh, you can buy one game or buy a bunch of them to save on shipping. Um, please PM me. Don't put um, you know comments below saying you want this and that. Uh, I'll go by PMs. Uh, first come, first serve. That way it's not confusing with the times of the PMs and comments. So. Um, as far as trade goes, I only want loose NES games that I don't have for my collection. Um, I don't want anything else. So if you don't have any loose games that I need for my collection, uh, we're just not going to make a trade, I'm sorry. Um, but you're more than welcome to buy the game if you want. Um, another option, I don't know if it really makes sense, but you could always buy a game on eBay that I need um, for equal value of some games that I have and have it shipped to me and then I'll ship you the games but it would just make more sense just to buy straight from me and me ship it out um, what else there will be a link in the description below um, or just in the description below of all the games remaining for my NES collection so that way you know what games I need and if you need if you have an expensive game and want a bunch of stuff from me you know we can do a trade like that like I'll, I'll do I'll trade a bunch of stuff for one expensive game you know try to give you a good deal but I believe that is it and I think we should get started okay the first thing I have uh, I'm gonna let Sega Stoner get first crack at this so if he gets I give him three days to um, see this video and decide if he wants to get this or not I'm sure he's I wouldn't be surprised if you wanted it. Um, I think it's on a video I just put up too. Uh, it's this Sonic the Hedgehog pinball machine. And everything does work. It's kind of loud. It's pretty cool. I don't know if you guys can really see much what it's doing, but. Uh, the one on eBay right now, um, I think it's the Galaxy version of this, um, is up there for like $59. I don't think it's worth $59, but um, Sega Stoners sent me a, a um, an offer on it if you want it. Um, if not, other people can send their send their offers in. It would be first come first serve. Um, and if he doesn't get it, then I'll send it to one of you guys. Uh, I am thinking it's probably going to cost maybe I'm guessing around ten dollars to ship uh, wherever it's going. So keep that in mind when you make an offer on it. Um, it doesn't need to be anywhere near fifty nine dollars. Uh, that's the first thing. Uh, I've also decided to get rid of all of my plug and plays. Um, I just don't really play them and they're cool to look at, <laughs> but um, I'd rather sell them and, or trade them for NES games I need. Um, I already have enough Pac Mans and stuff, so I've got four of them. And all these go anywhere from $10 up to $30 on eBay. So I'm going to say each one of these I will sell for 
I'm gonna say fourteen dollars. Each one is fourteen dollars plus shipping, which is probably around four or five bucks. So we'll say eighteen dollars shipped, and it's yours. Um, of course, that's within the U.S. If you're out of the country and you want one of these, please PM me and we can work something out. Um, the first one is the Namco one with, uh, I'm not sure what games are on it. Uh, it's a few games on there. You can look it up. Uh, the next one, this is a kind of a rare one. Harder to get one. Uh, it's a Pac-Man. Everything does work. Just letting you guys know. Uh, pretty cool. This is a very popular one that sells on eBay. Uh, the Miss Pac-Man one. And this is one I just found that you'll see probably in a way future video, um, which I've never seen before. Uh, this is a Super Pac-Man one, so that's pretty cool. By Namco. Um, so all these, oh yeah, and if you guys want to get more than one thing, just let me know, and I'll you know combine shipping and make it cheaper. Um, so all those are $18 each shipped. Um, if I don't sell them, I'm just going to put them on eBay and get the same amount for them. So either way, it doesn't matter to me. So I'm just trying to let my subscribers get first crack at it. Um, next up, this is something found that you're going to see in a future video. Um, these are pretty rare. This is a Virtue Cop um, Sega gun for the Sega for the Sega Saturn. I'm pretty sure it's Sega Saturn, but the reason why it's black is because this is the import version from Japan, and of course the U.S. versions had to be like a bright orange, so kids don't go um, shooting up store or you know robbing banks with uh, fake guns um, but I'm pretty sure this is really hard to find uh, especially here in the states so if you want this um, make me an offer on it the orange ones go for anywhere from like 10 to 30 bucks on eBay so um, I don't know what the black one will go for so if you do have an import and you want it, I don't know, give me an email. Next thing up, we got, I have two of these so I don't need two red ones. Uh, a red Nintendo 64 controller. Everything's awesome, it's like in perfect condition. Uh, I'll do, what did I say on this? I will do, these are actually kind of pricey on eBay, so nine bucks plus three dollars shipping, so twelve dollars shipped, it's yours. Um, next up, I don't know who's going to want this, just for collecting purposes, uh, it's an original Defense Command and Stellar Escort game for uh, the Radio Shack TRS-80 it has all this in here. I'm not sure if it's complete. Pretty sure it's complete. I have no idea what it's worth. Um, it is from like 1983. Um, make me an offer on it that I can't refuse or else it's going up on eBay. Um, there's that. Next thing up is 
This thing works awesome right here. I tested it out just a little bit ago. We have a Yobo um, NES uh, clone. Everything works excellent on it. It's funny, it's actually clearer with this than it is on my regular NES. It doesn't have like the lines like the regular NES does. But it comes with power cord and AV cables. And it comes with four controllers. I'm going to do $10 on that, uh, plus uh, five bucks shipping. So for 15 bucks, you can get that. Everything does work good on that. Um, and now into some games, a lot of games. I got a NBA Live, Sega Saturn, NBA Live 97, I don't know if anybody wants this. Do two bucks plus, I don't know, 250 shipping because it's going to cost some money to ship. So maybe you want to buy a couple games to lower the cost of shipping. But yeah, the case is kind of fucked up. But NBA Live 97. Uh, Mortal Kombat 2 for the Super NES. Do $4. Plus two dollar shipping on that. You got a couple Atari games, Pac-Man. Do a dollar plus a dollar shipping, or plus a dollar fifty shipping. I'm sorry, so two fifty. Um, Defender. Same thing, two fifty shipped. You got NBA Jam for Sega Genesis with a bunch of stickers on it. A dollar plus a dollar fifty shipping, so two fifty ship for that. Sonic 2 on Genesis. Um, same thing. Dollar plus two dollars fifty cents, so two fifty ship on that. We got Pokemon Snap. I'll do two plus two for this, so four dollars shipped on that. We got Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories for PlayStation. Um, it is missing the manual, but it's got the disc in awesome condition. I'm gonna do five dollars plus two dollars shipped for that, so seven bucks shipped. Uh, I got this Batman Tiger game. I don't know if any of you are Batman fans. Uh, I haven't really tested it out. It does come on and stuff. Um, I don't know. I'll say five bucks shipped for this, and it's yours. Got a couple NES RF adapters. I got two of them. Um, I'll do I'll do four dollars shipped on each of these. Road Rash Two for Sega Genesis. I'll do two dollars plus two dollars shipping for that. Um, no, Ed, this is not the one that you gave me. Um, I found another one. This is a Doom 32X game, so $2 plus $2 shipping on that. Uh, let's see. Sonic Spinball, $2 plus $2 shipping on that. Monopoly, $2 plus $2 shipping for that. Um, Beavis and Butthead for Sega Genesis is in a yellow rental case, I'm pretty sure. Um, has the game, some stickers on it, no manual. 
I'll do two dollars plus three dollars shipping for that. So five bucks. You got F22. It's complete. It's falling apart. Doesn't really stay in there, but it, it's got the game, game and manual and stuff. Kind of torn up, but two dollars plus two dollars ship for that. So four bucks total for that. Um, a couple more expensive games. And like I said, I, I do, I really want to trade for some NES games that I don't have, so there will be a link in the description um, where you can take a look at all the NES games that are remaining on my list that I'll trade for. I'm not going to trade for anything else other than NES games I need. So if you try to trade something that for another system, I don't. I just don't want it. I only want it for the NES, and uh, you'll just have to buy it if you want it. Um, all right, we got Mike Tyson Punch Out. I'm gonna do seven bucks plus two dollars shipping on this, so nine dollars shipped. We got Burger Time. Um, I'll do four dollars plus two dollars shipped for this, so six bucks total. And then all these other ones are going to be. Um, All these other ones are going to be $2 each, any of them, um, plus $1.50 shipping. So $3.50 each for, three fifty each shipped for each of these. And if you get more than one or whatever, uh, you know, we'll work out the shipping or whatever. But I got a bunch of them, so. Got NARC. Championship Bowling, Cobra Triangle, Kung Fu, Iron Sword, Wizards and Warriors 2, Mighty Bomb Jack, Bases Loaded 2, Dragon Warrior, Blades of Steel, Trojan, Arknoid, Robocop, Top Gun, RC Pro Am, 10 Yard Fight, Wizardry, Captain Skyhawk, Double Dribble. Hunter, Marble Madness, Snoopy's, Jeopardy, Shadowgate, Pro Wrestling. Athena, Operation Wolf, Top Gun, D 
Demon Sword. Bad Street Brawler. Renegade. And also this one, uh, Mortal Kombat for Sega Genesis. That'll be $2 plus $1.50 shipping too. So, um, let's see. I think I have anything else. I have some manuals. If anybody wants them, just, just uh, send me a, send me a PM and Send me two bucks or something. Two dollars each. That's pretty much just to cover the shipping. Or a dollar fifty, I don't even care. Uh, I got it. I just don't need these. Gauntlet Legends for the N64. Instruction manual. We got War Wizards of um, Warcraft. Frozen Throne. I'm not sure what it's for. Probably PlayStation. Or PC or something. Miss Spider's Tea Party, PlayStation. Uh, we got City of Heroes. I have no idea what that's for. Two two bucks for this one because it's shipped to you um, because it's kind of heavy. So. And I also got Madagascar and just like a paper sleeve. If anybody wants it for a couple bucks shipped. Um. But that is it. So please PM me if you want any of that stuff. I think that's it. I'm really trying to focus now on completing my NES collection. I'm going to kind of chill out on buying. Well, a lot of the videos you're going to see is going to have, is going to contradict what I just said um, because I got a ton of videos still to put out. And that's why I've been putting out videos back to back to back. Um, but I'm gonna try to chill out on anything except NES games. Uh, but PM me, let me know, and talk to you guys later.